So this is going to be the most different YouTube automation monetization video that you've ever seen in your life because we're using Google and I'm super excited. So before we move on, just so you know that I'm not on no crap crap, this is one of my channels. I got it monetized in less than a week. All right. This is Anti-Job University TV. And then this one over here, this is my main channel, Anti-Job University. I want to show you my highest earning video. This is my highest earning video. We made $6,254 off of one video and that could have monetized this channel with that one video if it wasn't already monetized. So for a bonus of you watching this video to the end, I'm going to give you this three YouTube virality formulas guaranteed to work no matter if it's a new channel or a dead channel. It doesn't matter. Okay, guys, I've done this over and over across multiple channels. I know how to go viral when I need to. Okay. All right. So just in case you're wondering what you're going to need, all you're going to need is access to Google. You're not going to need any type of vid IQ tools. No offense to them. You're not going to need any uh, TubeBuddy tools for keyword research or anything like that. This is going to be an entirely different uh, way of getting traffic to your YouTube channels. Uh, we're going to be using Google instead, instead of trying to rank on YouTube. All right. So now you're not going to need to do any promoting on any other platform. So I'm not going to tell you to post in Facebook groups when you're done with your video. You're not going to have to do any collaborations or shout outs. And you're definitely not going to need any Mr. Beast clips and cuts and retention type tricks for your videos to get people to stay to the end. This is going to be fairly simple. We're using Google, like I said. So the first formula that I'm going to show you guys, because I teach my students SEO. All right. You want to find keywords instead of doing YouTube uh, keyword research like you're used to doing instead of trying to rank for, uh, let's say, sign language for beginners on YouTube or for baby or something like that and trying to go through the competition. What you want to do is you want to harness the power, guys. Let me close this out. You want to harness the power of Google rankings instead. OK, why? Because then you'll be able to get traffic from both sources. Google owns YouTube. All right. So YouTube is ranked higher than websites most of the time. So look at this. We have songs in sign language step by step. And I'm going to show you guys how powerful it is. Like, let's say that you're trying to rank on YouTube and get views to your uh, YouTube autom automation videos and you're trying to get monetized and everything like that. What you can do is you can teach your virtual assistant to find keywords uh, in, in high competition niches. Right. So it might be difficult for you to rank for it with a video. I mean, with a website. But if it has has a video for that. If you can see videos on the first page of Google for that keyword, then you have a shot of still ranking with a YouTube video. So let me show you real quick the power of it. So it says songs and sign language step by step. So this video right here is ranking number two. Let me mute it so I don't get no type of a uh, copyright situation. All right. So this one has 630,000, I mean, 80,000 views. You might say, well, that's Disney music, of course. They have 32 million subscribers. Okay, all right, all right, you got me right there, but hold on. I got more. Look at this video right here. It's called Learn to Sign You Are My Sunshine. So this is a song for uh, uh, um, ASL, you know, sign language, American Sign Language. Now watch this. I'm going to pause this one. So I don't get demonetized or get some type of strike or something. Watch this. Look at this. 308,000 views on this video. So it's five years ago. But you're like, well, maybe they just always do that. How do I know we just didn't burst out? Well, look at their up-to-date videos. Look at this. A thousand views, a thousand views, two thousand views. They don't get this on a regular basis. So we're going to check what is the most popular video on this freaking channel. Mm, popular. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Does that happen to be this one right here that's ranking on Google? So these ones that are ranking on the first page of Google are the ones with the most views. Why? Because it's not just getting Google traffic, but it's also getting YouTube traffic. It's getting search engine love as well. So now maybe she just got lucky. Let's do a different one. <clears throat> so this one is ASL. So first, let me show you over here in the keyword uh, Google Keyword Planner, just so you're like, oh, well, how do we even know that gets searches? How do we know that's coming from uh, Google? You don't have any uh, access to their YouTube analytics or nothing. Well, this keyword gets around 100K to a million searches per month, according to this tool right here, right? So we can bet that if you rank on the first page of Google with a video, you're going to get a decent amount of traffic from that. So here goes a video right here. You're like, what? A video could rank on the first page of Google for something with that much volume and keyword volume? Yes, sir. Now let's open it up. Watch this. I told you this was going to be the most different video on YouTube about autom uh, automation monetization. Watch this. Okay. Now look at this video right here. <laughs> 6.2 million views. 
6.2 million views in two years. Okay, now you might say, well, maybe they just got a big channel. They got 430,000 subscribers. Maybe that's just how they do. Okay, well, let's come over here and let's look right here. Once again, as you can see, the regular videos don't get nowhere near that. Now we're going to look at the most popular so we can slam dunk all of the freaking theories. Okay, now I, just, well, I like that thumbnail though. Most popular is the one that I just showed you over there on Google. And then if you look at ASL Science, hold on, hold on, because this is the same channel, I think, for the next example. Watch this. We're going to do ASL Science. Oh, my God. Is this the same? This is the same channel. This is the same channel ranking for both. Let's click, let's click on it just to be sure. Maybe I'm mistaken. I know a lot of the uh, sarcastic stuff isn't called for, guys, but you got to be a little bit entertaining with it, right? Or you guys will go to sleep or something. I want you guys to be able to take advantage of this stuff and see how powerful it is to not only just rank on YouTube or try to go viral. See, with this method right here, there is no need for the Mr. Beast tactics or the knowing how to go viral tactics, even though I'm going to give you guys that in the formula, is no, it's no real need for you to know how to do a lot of that stuff. All you need to do is find keywords that has high traffic volume, high competition on YouTube, and then see, like, like what I mean by that is, you know that you would have no chance in hell ranking for that on YouTube. For example, email automation or something like that, or, or, or something that's super competitive on YouTube, right? A certain cooking, uh, cooking, uh, tutorials and stuff that you know you won't get no traffic for on YouTube. Go over to Google and test to see if there are videos on the first page of Google for some of those keywords. So just because it's competitive over there on YouTube does not mean that Google will not allow one of his own videos to rank on the first page of Google. And this is what I teach you on the Money Highways Ranking Bank SEO course. You guys definitely want to go over there and get that one. And I'll show you that in a minute. Um, okay, so here we go. Money Highways... <clears throat> And this is how I do it, guys. Whenever I want uh, a channel to blow the hell up or something, I have a few formulas. So this is 1997 right now. It's going to go up, right? Uh, I strongly suggest you get in here because we teach you how to get first week results guaranteed with a lot of this SEO stuff. So one of the formulas that I wanted to show you guys is this one right here. Timing uh, uh, audience uh, plus timing plus uniqueness equals viral video. Okay, so we can cut a couple of these out. Let me close those. I'll prove my point with this. So what do I mean by this formula right here? Audience. Audience, you can just switch that out with topic or like crowd of people, cult type stuff, whatever people, a group of people that are passionate about a specific thing, right? So that's the audience. And then you need timing. A lot of you guys know that is like trends. Some of these trends can be current, and, and and temporary. Others can be evergreen, right? And then uniqueness. Why do you want to add uniqueness to it? You want to add uniqueness to it because there's going to be other people talking about the same dang on topic as you're talking about it. So if you approach in the same way, then uh, even if you're on time, people will look at it like, you know, for example, there's a lot of channels that pop up during the UFC fights. They have the audience down pack and they have the timing down pack because, you know, they're going to stream it right when a fight happens. But but people will watch the video on their channel, but won't subscribe. They'll get 100,000 views, get all their watch hours and stuff, but they won't get the freaking subscription. Why? Because all they did was upload the fight no one is going to go down. Why would people want to subscribe to that channel? They didn't approach any with any uniqueness. So people can just go and subscribe to other channels, right? So uniqueness is what are you offering on your video that would make a person say, well, this one is different from every last one that I just watched, right? I want to come back to this. Maybe they got something else similar to this later. Boom. So audience plus time and uniqueness. Let me show you an example of this live. Let's go to Mr. Beast himself. Oh, ooh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. I told you it's formulas. There's no mistakes to this world. There's no mistake. God don't make mistakes. So now now he can do little goofy stuff like this. Why? Because he's already positioned. He already became the biggest guy on YouTube. But it was a time where it was a guy named PewDiePie that was the biggest guy on YouTube. And um, <laughs> uh, Mr. Jimmy or Mr. Beast, he was a little oak. You know, now he had already had, you know, a couple videos and stuff like that. Right. But he wasn't killing it yet. Right. So we can go to the oldest. Uh, now, this is going to like. This is going to be difficult to root through because now, since he's popular, a lot of people that went through and started watching his old stuff just for research purposes, kind of like what I'm doing with you guys right now. But OK, let me show you the one where he first really took off and it became permanent. I'll just go to search right here. And some of you guys might have seen this video. All right. Watch this. Uh, we'll say PewDiePie. 
PewDiePie, baby. Yes, Lord. Oh, my God. So we got, okay, where is the formula? Audience. PewDiePie was, at the time, was the biggest YouTube channel on YouTube. Like, people like watching this gaming and all of that extra stuff. Then we have timing. What do I mean timing? Watch this. Okay. I bought every billboard in my city for this. Same PewDiePie 100,000 times. At the time, PewDiePie was battling uh, T-Series. All right. To be the biggest YouTube channel on in history. Right. Like the biggest YouTube channel in history. OK, so most of the time uh, you'll see these channels just doing these little verses, T, uh, PewDiePie versus uh, uh, T-Series and stuff. All, every video was the same. All right. But he was the only one doing something extremely different. Like this dude stayed up all this time just saying PewDiePie freaking pie. Like they got to be hard as hell. So people had to watch to see if he was going to stop. Right. And then he bought every billboard in his city people know that that like cost hella money like he, he was doing stuff that other people couldn't do just for this and then something that i teach you guys is live stream bombing okay if somebody is live and they have like hundreds of thousands of subscribers or millions if you got some type of money like what he did was he did something that he knew would stand out in the comments i mean in the chat and it would draw attention to his channel and his name because everybody else might upload 50 uh 50 dollars or 500 dollars even you know or or five dollars or something pewdiepie is used to seeing that so he'll just keep on gaming and talking about what he's talking about but if, if you get a notification and sees a, a, a freaking notification a donation of super chat for freaking ten thousand dollars during this live stream he's going to scream that out he's going to scream that out so that was going to immediately draw attention to him right so uniqueness right here now i hate pewdiepie that was clickbaity type stuff right there you know but as you can see that was nine years ago it doesn't have nearly as many views as these you know what i'm saying look at the old ones the history of pewdiepie in two minutes he was still you uh Mr. Beast was still trying to figure out how this works and everything, but he usually used a positive uh, way of doing it. Like a lot of people would do those downfall of PewDiePie or down, you know, why PewDiePie sucks now or doesn't get views anymore. That's not different. Everybody is negative. So he approached with positive stuff, you know, and those are the ones that really like blew the hell up. Right. You know, uh, but he he went to something where he knew it was an audience. He waited for the right times. And then he did something extremely unique. Look at this. I advertise PewDiePie at the Super Bowl. Everybody down knows that the Super Bowl gets crazy amount of attention every freaking year. And there's going to be millions and millions of people watching. Now, look at this. He even put the little live sticker on there as if he created a commercial. And then he just took a picture of him and his friends from across the stadium holding up subscribe to PewDiePie. I mean, very freaking simple, guys. But he did something different. He got 43 million views. Notice the highest ones were from four years ago. And it's almost congruent. Four years ago, 43 million views ago. Uh, 46 million views four years ago. 38 million views four years ago. 25 million views four years ago. This literally made Mr. Beast. This is what catapulted him, catapulted him to you know where he is right now, guys. All right. So like now. I gave you guys a couple formulas. You can use Google, rank on Google to do this. And then you can use this formula right here. Audience plus timing plus unique, uh, uniqueness equals a viral video. Then we have one more right here. Okay. So like I said, if you want this, I give you to give it to you for free. You can comment, leave me document in the comments below. On top of that, you can join the Money Highways Ranking Bank SEO course to know how to rank overnight. We have 15 different fast monetization methods to increase your passive income. Like you, you get overnight ranking skills. Like the stuff we do, we can do this in a couple hours, sometimes a couple minutes, and it'd be on the first page of Google. Now, the next one is, uh, what is the next one? Okay. So the next one is this, guys. You want to be different. You want to stand out. You want to make sure that you're serving a market that is underserved. All right. So we have demand. OK, demand plus supply. OK, OK. So there are things that have uh, um, little supply, you know what I'm saying? All right. But it's a high demand for it. Right. So we want to uh, do this right here. Let's see. Let's go over here and we'll say we'll say dancing for Parkinson's disease. <laughs> OK, so this is a formula that I came up with. And we know that people are all people, no matter what their disadvantage is. So if you think of their disadvantage or their disability or their uh, pain point or their um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, their disease or whatever it is, 
plus the pleasure, right? So the pleasure plus their disadvantage, the reward plus their disadvantage, right? Their entertainment plus their disadvantage. Look, this is Parkinson's disease. Like they move a little bit different. So you know, you know, they're going to feel a little insecure about certain things just like you do, right? So we'll put dancing right there. That opens up a market. There's no competition for this, right? Look at these. 2017, 2009, right? It's no competition. You'll rank on the first page of Google. We got some videos ranking. Look how old they are. Google has something called the refreshing algorithm. They're ready to replace a lot of this old stuff. So you just redo the same thing. This is why this one is ranking first because it has exact match keywords. So if you try to optimize for ranking on Google instead of YouTube, you can get on here for something like this. All right, then we'll have um, dating for blind people. Look at this dating site from a blind person. Like, I mean, come on, it's, it's a demand. Like blind people still want to date, but here's their dis disability, being blind. So their goal, their reward is to find a freaking date. So you combine those, the disability, the disadvantage, the disease or whatever with, uh, uh, you know, the, the pleasure right there. Look at this visually impaired singles. This is bringing up an entirely different niche just out of nowhere. I didn't even know nothing about this. See, formulas, guys. All right. And you can rank for this stuff. We got an app ranking on the first page, a Reddit from 2017. Okay. And then we got some videos ranking on the first page of Google. So I just gave you guys what three formulas back to back. Uh, do a uh, a high knee kick from Tony Ja Ung Bak movie to the subscribe button and do a backspin uh, fist from freaking Conor McGregor to the like button, right? Make sure you guys go out and start testing this stuff. Join the Money Highways Rank and Bank SEO course where it will teach you all of this stuff. Get your duckets in a row. Get your penny straight because you can make a lot of this stuff happen. You can rank your videos, your websites, your assets, and be monetized quickly. Love you.